Hello everyone, my name is Diana Munoz. I am a Canva certified creative and also an online instructor. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to create this meme that you see right here. And what I love about this meme is that it has movement and also is very personalized. As you can see, I'm using a video of myself and the cool thing is that I removed the background of this video so I could achieve a more clean or a more aesthetic meme design. Okay, so I'm going to teach you everything in this tutorial and you can use a Canva free account or a Canva Pro account. So are you guys ready for this tutorial? Let's go to my computer. Okay, so here we are in my computer and the first thing that you would like to do is to go to my Canva public profile. I left you guys the link in the description of this video and we are here because I created a template for a meme. So you can see it here. What you would like to do is to click on it and Canva will open this preview page or this preview window. And here you can either like this template if you want to have access to it later on on the Canva editor. You can also share this design with your friends. The link is copied to your clipboard and then you can just paste it in your Facebook chat or any other place that you would like to share this template. And then you can also use this template. So let's go here and Canva will open this template on your Canva editor. In this exercise, I'm using a Canva free account so you can see that at the end, we will be able to download this meme without any issues. Okay, the first thing that you would like to do is to change this photo because this one is supposed to be your photo, right? So I already have my photo in my uploads and I'm going to drag it inside this frame. You can adjust it by clicking two times and move your photo if you wish or you can also make it bigger. I think I'm going to go like this and then you can change your username. I will use my name and then for the handle, I'm going to use my Instagram handle here. Okay, so you can change the text here, of course, and you can also change the image but wait until the end because i'm going to show you how i removed the background from a video of myself so let's delete this image because we won't use it in this design and i'm going to change the text here for the meme that i want to create okay good so i have my text here and now what i'm missing is this little video without the background right okay so now that i have the layout ready for my meme i just need to include the image the funny image or the funny video i have here a little section of one of my tutorials usually when i create these tutorials i make mistakes <laughs> and i make funny faces when i realized that i made a mistake so i cut this little section of my funny face and this is the video that i'm going to use as you can see it's not even a second it's less than a second but i think this eye movement is going to work and it's it's a funny face <laughs> i think okay so before uploading this video to canva we are going to go to this website unscreen.com so let's drop the video inside this platform and the platform is going to remove the background automatically from this video so before we used to have this blue background and now we don't have because i'm using the free version of this platform i will be able to download this file only as gif png and single frames but for this tutorial because i want to have the movement of the eyes i will need to download it as gif and also i think it's very important to mention that if you are going to be using the free version of this platform you will have a little watermark here we cannot see it pretty well in this specific video but there is a watermark here so if you don't want to have watermarks on your videos 
you will need to go for the pro version of this platform you will be able to download the videos without watermark full length full hd mp4 videos and it also supports audio so it sounds pretty nice well for this example i use the free version and i think it's going to be okay now let's drop this video without the background inside canva and the cool thing about canva is that we can upload gif video images and also audio we can upload audio now if you want me to create a tutorial on how to upload audio let me know i'll be happy to do it okay so here we're waiting for this bar to disappear that bar obviously was uh, telling us that the file was uploading to canva so now we are fine because the bar is not present here and we can add it to our design now let's adjust the position and also something that i'd like to do in my designs is to crop the excessive um, empty space like this and then done and now that our meme is ready you would like to go here to download if your meme doesn't have a gif or a video but you are using a photo let's say here instead of this video you have a photo you can download your meme as a png jpeg there is no problem here but because in this meme in particular i'm having like this eye movement and that's what kind of like makes funny this meme I would like to download it either as a video format or a GIF. So for this example, I think I'll go for GIF. This format, I can upload it to Facebook and also to YouTube in the community tab. And this GIF will loop automatically. So I really like that. But if you're going to use this meme on Instagram, let's say, you would like to download it as a MP4 video. As on Instagram, you cannot upload GIF files. Okay, so this is the final version of my meme. If you happen to create your own meme, I would love you guys to tag me on your designs. I love to see what you guys are creating, so don't forget to tag me. I'm going to leave my handle here. If you have any tutorial suggestion, let me know in the comments. I know that some of you left some comments suggesting that I create a tutorial on how to find more hidden elements. So if there is more people interested in that tutorial, just let me know so I can create that tutorial. Meanwhile, if you are interested in learning more about Canva, I'm going to leave here some videos that I guess I think you are going to like. And also I'm going to leave here a link so you can enjoy Canva Pro for free for 45 days. That's 15 days more than what you will get on Canva's website. So if you are interested, go and check it out. So that's it for this tutorial. I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!